Hey guys, today I'm going to talk to you about my little Sedona Lace Black Friday um, sale haul. So I picked up 15 brushes. I picked up the uh, I picked up the 12 piece professional makeup brush set in the color pink. I picked up a round top kabuki, a universal blender, and a synthetic blender. My initial game plan for the um, sale was to pick up the Universal Blender, the Synthetic Blender, and the Round Top Kabuki. I also really, really, really wanted the brand new set that uh, Sedona Lace put out. It's called the Vortex Synthetic um, Professional Brush Shed or something like that. And it's pink like this one right here. But, mm, couldn't get my hands on it. It sold out so freaking fast. It's ridiculous. So maybe next year I'll, I'll get that one. Who knows? We'll, we'll see. My order took exactly seven days um, to get to my house, which isn't bad. It came in a plain brown box. And then inside that box was this box right here. And so that was the little makeup roll for the 12 piece brush set. Looks like this. Perfect for if you are, you know, traveling a lot or maybe you're a makeup artist or something. And then the um, three extra brushes came in this little thing. The set also came with a pamphlet telling you which each telling you what each brush um does so that's that i forgot to mention the sale was um 50 off so that's an awesome deal especially considering that other brands only did free shipping or um 20 off but you have to pay for shipping so this is an awesome deal or it was an awesome deal it was 50% off and free shipping um, within the US I don't know if they did international but for for sure within the US if you spent more than $50 so awesome and usually they do they always have sales year-round there's some sort of sale going on so I really love Sedona Lace the quality of the brushes and the fact that they care about their customers pockets my total um, purchase cost $63 and some change, but thankfully I had money saved up from Ebates and Ibotta and $30 out of pocket. These are the Sedona Lace 480 brushes. These are my favorite brushes for applying foundation. Now the website also says that these are perfect for um, blending out harsh um, cheek color, but I have not tried um, that yet. These are regular price $18.95. This is the EB09 or the Universal Blender Brush. Um, you can use this to, you can use this part, the flat part, to pack on your eyeshadow, or you can use the tip to apply um, your crease color, which is what I do. This is regular price, I want to say $13.95. These are the EB13s or the synthetic blender brushes. Um, these are regular price $13.95. I use these for blending out my crease color. Um, I also know that some people use them for concealer. I have not tried that yet. This is the 376 powder brush. This is regular price $18.95. This is perfect for um your all over powder and I just lost a hair boo this dual fiber brush is a um, 813 no, 813 this is also 19 or 18 dollars and 95 cents um, this is perfect for foundation I do not use it for foundation actually I have not used it at all so if you know something that I can use this for other than foundation, please let me know. This 727 brush is a foundation brush. Um, 
I don't really know anyone that uses this type of foundation brush. So what I'm going to use it for is face mask to apply my face mask. I was going to just let Avery have it to play with, but then someone was like, um, hello, face mask. And I was like, oh, you're right. Sorry, Avery. This is the 850 brush, um, the large angled contour brush. Um, so obviously it's for contour. I don't contour. So maybe when I start, I will use this bad boy. This is $16.95. This is the concealer brush, the 954. This is $13.95 and you know, it's for concealer. I would also use it for maybe my brow bone or I don't know. I'd say you could probably use it for your inner corner highlight. This is the medium angled um, shading brush. This is the 407 brush and I use this to um, deepen up my crease and my outer V area. This is also $13.95. The 561 is the small angled brush. Um, perfect for, I would say, you know, people would use this for eyeliner, but it looks a little thick to me. So, and I don't really use these brushes for eyeliner, so I don't know what I'm going to use it for. This is the large shader brush, the 941, also $13.95. Um, I would not use this for eyeshadow. Like, my eye space is not that big to just use this to pack on eyeshadow. But I think this could be used for concealer. And um, I've actually used it to, like, blend my highlight and my transition color so it's not um, so noticeable. So I guess that could be... I use for it also. Now this is probably one of my favorite brushes in this set. The next time Sedona Lace has any sort of sale, 20%, 25%, anything, I'm jumping on it. it. This is the tapered blending brush, the 863. I love this for my crease. Like, I love this for my crease. The 904 pencil brush is also one of my favorites. Um, I really like to put color on my bottom lash line and this really does the trick. Before what I was using for um, my bottom lash line was the e.l.f. professional blending eye brush which is super stiff and it hurts and it doesn't do shit and I need to throw it away or let Avery play with it. Um, after that, what I was using for, as a pencil brush, was this Morphe M151 brush, and it's just a little too soft. This one is soft also, but it's perfect for, I don't know how to explain it, like they feel the same, but this one does a better job, and I want to say it's because of, um, how it's shaped. I don't know how to explain it, but I like this one better. Next we have the 305 eye shading brush. Obviously this is for packing on eyeshadow. Lastly we have the um, eyeliner brush which is the 772. I have not tried this brush yet, but um, it seems okay. Um, I don't think I'm going to try this brush to be honest. I. I don't know. We'll see. I'll keep you updated if I try this. <laughs> so that was my run through of everything I got from Sedona Lace. Did you guys order? What did you get? Um, are you hoping to order anything soon? I really want an extra tapered um, blending brush and I want that Vortex set. Like I told myself after I missed it, oh it's okay. I don't really want it anyway. Lies lies i want it that fan brush is so beautiful i think i might just want the fan brush i don't know i don't know but i'm definitely i definitely need another one of these and um i don't like to pay for shipping so i knowing me i'll just be like oh 
I don't pay for shipping and then other things into my cart. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.